Welcome to the Joy of Music, featuring the First Lady of the Organ, Diane Bish. We invite you to meet great composers and performers, travel to Europe's ancient monasteries and snow-covered Alps, visit great historical cathedrals and beautiful lakes and gardens. Praise ye the Lord. Praise Him with stringed instruments and organs. Praise Him with a psaltery and harp. Praise Him with a trumpet. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. And now, Miss Diane Bish. We would like to welcome you today to the joy of music as we bring you a program entitled Creation. Every day we have the wonderful opportunity of looking around us and appreciating the beauty that God has given us. The flowers, the trees, lakes, mountains, and so many different things. Today in our world there are many theories about creation and who gave us all of these things we enjoy and even where we as humans come from. But the Bible tells us that in the beginning was God and God created the heavens and the earth. And on the program today, we're going to be listening to music which was inspired by creation. We open the program with Morning Has Broken, the morning of creation, when God created the heavens and the earth and you and me. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth, and the earth was formless and empty, and darkness was on the surface of the deep, and the Spirit of God was hovering over the waters. And God said, Let there be light. And there was light, and God saw the light, that it was good. And God separated the light from the darkness, and God called the light day, and the darkness he called night.
For ye shall find your delight in the Almighty. God, as the Almighty Creator, has invited us to worship Him and adore Him and to know Him in a personal way. The great and mighty hymn of faith praise to the Lord, the Almighty, the King of creation, invites us to praise and worship Him. think about the creation of God, sometimes we forget about animals, the dogs and cats, birds, and so many dear animals that surround us every day and bring joy into our lives. In Genesis, we read this, and God said, let the earth bring forth the living creature after his kind, cattle and creeping thing, and beast of the earth after his kind. And it was so. And we have composers that have written about animals and what a joy they are to us because every animal has a personality and a unique characteristic. In the composition, The Carnival of the Animals by Saint-Saëns, we get just a little taste of each animal's personality. We hear now excerpts from The Carnival of the Animals as played by Nielsen and Young duo pianists. Introduction and Royal March of the Lion.
the lion, king of the beasts. and roosters. The mules. The animal's grand finale.
is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. Another scripture which reminds us that God not only created this earth, but it belongs to him. Another hymn which is sung by so many across this land is this is my father's world. Why should my heart be sad? And for those who belong to him, they can sing this hymn from their hearts and know that we are directed and guided and taken care of by a heavenly father. The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament showeth his handiwork. 
This is one of the many verses in the Bible that tells us about God's creation. From Haydn's creation, his most famous oratorio, we have the anthem, The Heavens Are Telling. And from this, we also have a hymn that is sung in many churches across our land. The spacious firmament, the spacious firmament on high with all the blue ethereal sky and spangled heavens a shining frame, their great original proclaim. The unwearied sun from day to day does his creator's power display and publishes to every land the work of an almighty hand. Today on The Joy of Music, we have been listening to music which reflects and describes the creation of God, the creation of this earth and heaven and of every living thing. We started the program with Morning Has Broken, the creation of the earth. But God tells us that if we give our lives to Him in a personal walk and relationship, that we will become new creations. And if we have that relationship, we will also share with him in his creation of heaven. And so we end the program with morning has broken, the morning 
of eternal life and heaven. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. The saints of all ages join in the light of his eternal morning. <laughs>